Here's the part that should make every security leader sit up and pay attention. Anthropic estimates that Claude executed 80 to 90% of the tactical work autonomously from reconnaissance and vulnerability discovery to lateral movement, credential harvesting, data analysis, and exfiltration. Humans were only stepping in at key decision points to say yes, continue, or stop. To pull this off, the attackers built an autonomous attack framework around Claude and model context protocol tools. Think of Claude as the orchestration engine. It scanned infrastructure and mapped attack surfaces, identified and validated vulnerabilities even writing its own exploit code. Harvested credentials, escalated privileges, and moved laterally across networks. It queried databases, pulled sensitive data, and even categorized it by intelligence value. Then documented everything in Markdown so other operators could pick up where it left off. The human role shrank to about 10 to 20% of the total effort, mostly approving escalation steps and final data exfiltration. At peak, Claude was issuing thousands of requests, often multiple per second, something no human red team could match. 